Yeah, that body's a blessing, girl. I ain't trying to pressure her. She messed with the temperature. Hey Guardians, what is going on? Nick City from the Sticky Socks and welcome to today's video. So today the weekly update dropped a day earlier than normal, but anyway, I'm here to bring you the news. So first of all, challenge modes have been announced and we have a date. So they're going to come early in December. You would imagine they will come with the update. I think the update is dropping the 9th of December. Don't quote me on that, but I think it's something like that. So what is in it? They're basically just said that early in December, one of the King's Fall bosses will offer their challenge each week. So you'd imagine this will go on for four weeks. See, we have gotten a screenshot of um, only three of them being the War Priest, Golgoroth and Oryx. I can't see there being one for the Death Singer says there's no special thing you could really do for that. So all the only thing we got at hinting it is they said that apologies in advance to those that run the single pool strat for Golgoroth. So that's a little hint that I would imagine saying that you're probably going to definitely use all six bubbles for the Golgoroth one. Maybe it's kill him in only six bubbles, who knows. So next up then we have a flow chart here showing off the kill death ratio of guardians as per their light levels. All of basically is showing off the fact that the guardians with a higher level light is in fact getting a higher KD. Just proving that the light level system is actually working where balance say if you're 260 and going up against a 300 there is actually a difference. And as you can actually see from this chart no one has actually reached 320 yet as you can see because there's no one up at the top of that chart. Which is interesting and it just proves that the raid system is as broken as fuck. So then finally we do have a statistic here and this is related to the complaints that came in about the uh, map this weekend for Trials that was Rusted Lands. So it was quite simply where everyone's complaining that it's an asymmetrical map which basically means that there's more cover on one side than the other or else it might be more advantageous for snipers on one side than the other and so on. So all this is just proved that it was actually 50-50 and there's no need for people to be complaining. If they're complaining they're only bitching for no reason and they shouldn't really be. So guys, that is the end of the video. That's all that was put into the weekly update. If there's anything interesting again next week, I will report on this. Please like and subscribe. And remember, stay sticky, Guardians.